have show notes. You have show notes? Let's yep. go. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> nice. <laughs> the, I'm not even going to show anybody, but it basically just says, like, talk about things. <laughs> yeah, it says, it says uh, names. Okay, let's start the group. Start the group. That's funny. Let's do it again. Uh, my name is Aaron Master. All right. My name is Josh Howard. And um, what is Check. this called? This is a uh, Lark Radio. Cute theme music. Lark Radio. Now. Is that what we're calling? It? Oh yeah. No, I don't. I don't know. I mean, it is. It's done. <laughs> I think. I think that's a thing on uh, iTunes, right? I don't know, man. Like where they have like Pack Radio. Like oh, oh yeah, yeah. And then Queen Radio. She's right. Nicki Minaj's. Yeah, yeah. She got Queen Radio. Yeah. <laughs> no, let's talk about it. I don't know how I feel about that. Well, she's like that's her like. That's the name of her last album. And then I just feel like there are other women women artists that would have gotten that first in hip hop, in music. Beyonce, Madonna. Beyonce's not doing a podcast for Apple. Oh music. yeah, okay, I got you. I got you. Yeah, maybe that's what it is. Maybe she's. The, I have a gun in my mouth. Angela Yee would kill me. Who's that? Angela Yee. Who's that? It's Breakfast Club. Okay. You know the girl in the Breakfast Club. I know. Charlemagne, DJ Envy, Angela Yee. Bro, I don't. Wow. Listen, I just started. <laughs> I just started watching movies. <laughs> so. You know. See episode three of the yeah, vlogs. Yeah, right. Yeah, See yeah. Episode three of the vlogs. <laughs> All right. Well, this is Lark Radio. Yeah. I don't really know what that means. Yeah. How about this? You got any ads? Ads? Yeah. Nah, man. Wow. Not yet. All right, I got you. I got you. <laughs> All right, hit me Ask with an me. ad. You, hey, man, you got any ads? This episode is brought to you by the band Lark. Oh, okay. All right. We're <laughs> our own sponsor. Debut album came out. We're our own sponsor. That's cool. Bro, we are our own sponsor. All right. No, you're We're right. You're right. You're right. Uh, album came out in November. That's right. Crushing. Crushing album. Crushing. Check it out. It's called The Glow. All streaming platforms. You got a book? Yeah, Come I do. On, bro. I do a book. You're right. Link I got it. I got Yeah, you're right. <laughs> check my <laughs> <on>. <laughs> link. <laughs> yeah, I got a. I got a base book. If you want to learn how I do some stuff, check out this base book. This podcast is brought to you by. What's the name of the book? What's the name of the book? Uh, <laughs> hold on. Let me think of it. Let me think of it. I can't think of the name of my own book. I think it's like chords for four five and six string bass it's pretty real sexy snappy title <laughs> i'm into it <laughs> at jhal275 <laughs> yeah, that's right check me out on twitch instagram <laughs> soundcloud there you go let's you get know. to the show yeah, yeah all right anyway this is where something will happen here like yeah yeah music. we'll put we'll put real information here yeah yeah or yeah, yeah real music i'm there. super hyped to write ads <laughs> I want to write ads. I want. I want to read somebody's ads. Yo, somewhere. this this show is brought to brought to you by my new tattoo. Mm. Check it out on Instagram. Shout go. out to Studio Six One Seven. Oh, what is that? That's the studio. That's the the place. All I right, let's to. do it again. Yeah, my yeah. Bad. All right, okay. <laughs> so, shout out to Studio Six One Seven in Maryville, Tennessee. Maryville. Um, Chris Ford Maryville. crushed it. Follow him on Instagram. That's how you know you're from Niceville when you say Maryville. At Merville. I said I said Maryville. Maryville. Still, <laughs> yeah, dude. Yeah, you're still right. It's not much better. <laughs> Maryville. Anyways. Anyway. So, so the po- okay, so the purpose of this po- of this version of Lark Entertainment. Yeah, man, give it to us. It's basically gonna be I'm gonna be sitting down. Say entertainment? Yep. That sounded sick. I told you, I'm a brand master, <laughs> Doc. Uh I'm gonna be sitting down with different members of Lark different people that we work with and probably eventually other bands to basically just talk music. Yes. Uh, You know, I think I love listening to artists talk about the craft that they uh, partake in day in and day out. And so uh, that was kind of the, the, the deal with this is, you know, we talk about music behind the scenes all the time. We go and play these gigs. We make connections Uh with people. We talk about music there. You know, we do, we do as of right now, you know, I guess we've not really done any teaching as a group, but you know, we all teach, yeah, and we have, we have some, we have some. Uh, oh, oh, yeah, yeah, we got some stuff on online. Yeah, you're right. So you know, we talk about music all the time, and and we love, and we love sharing about it. And uh, 
And uh, yeah, the cool, the cool thing is that naturally this group, the you know the people in this group, and the people that we work with are like kind of all down to talk. <laughs> you know yeah, I mean? yeah, yeah. I mean, like any artist likes talking about themselves, but that's not really what we're talking about. Yeah, we're, yeah, yeah. we're like, you know, we There's we like so much we're gonna be able to talk about the glow. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Great album, even by though way. it's sick. It's um, sick. Yeah. sick. Uh, it did its job. <laughs> yeah. Um, but uh, you know, one what one thing is. Job? All right, here's <laughs> here's how it looked in my head. The job of the glow was just to introduce to us, to introduce people to our music personality. I okay. feel like it did. Okay. There's a lot of stuff going on in the album, but I think, you know, yeah. we were kind of like a... I was scared that it was kind of a lot too much. Like, not... It's very streamlined, you know? Like, there's no oh, sound, yeah. you know? Sure. But I think there's definitely an identity. I think so, too. Like you were saying. That was That was like... Something that I learned in a band that I was in a long time ago that was a huge flop, uh, and nobody could get along. What's the name? Can't mention it. <laughs> I can't. Um, well, my Wendy Williams. Because I, I know. Because I yeah, right. <laughs> because I, I still like everybody in the band, but as a band, it just was not amazing. Okay. Um, but one thing I because lo- I was really worried we were writing all this music. <laughs> no, no, no. Because uh, <laughs> we were writing all this music for that band, and I was like super uptight about it because none of our songs were related to each other, yeah. stylistically, anything like that. And I was like, I was like, I was like, what are we, what are we even doing with our lives? Like, it just felt like a waste of time. <laughs> it feels like like an existential crisis. Existent- Ooh, what is he? How do you say that? Existential. It's, it feels like that when you make making music and you're like. In in your head, all four of you are like, oh, this band is going to be all these things. Yeah. And then when you start writing music and you can see that people care certain amounts of right. ways and yeah. people write music in different ways and you vision it in your head. Yep. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, being in a band is hard. <laughs> it makes you, it feels like you're in a rela- well, you are in a relationship. Yeah, for real though. But one of the cool things was somebody else in the band was like, was like, dude, it's going to sound like it's going to have a sound because we all sound a specific way. Mm. And I was like, BS. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, that's. I was about to say, I didn't think that's. I don't know if that flies with 20. Well, how old were you? Uh, or I you was, can't say. Um, I, I, mean, I, was probably, I was probably a little younger. I was probably like 25. It doesn't sound like something 25 year old Josh would take. It was not. <laughs> it, but, uh, but he was totally right. Cool. You like our the whole that, that yeah. album turned out pretty good and and I think anyway so fast forward to now Lark even though I think ass. fast forward to Lark I think uh, even though we kind of did that you know we kind of like did a, kind of anything we wanted mm-hmm. which was a which was a goal for the band at first um, I think it still kind of sounds like us yeah me too cool. me too and I think I don't know still you know. Part part of that is like I trust all of you guys a lot, so there was not like yeah. even though I can be like a micromanaging person, <laughs> I didn't sound like you. <laughs> I I just finding that out more and more in our in our lives. It's hilarious. It's coming, man. Trust me. One yeah. day it's gonna hit you in the face. <laughs> no. <laughs> well, I'll make sure the camera's on when that happens. <laughs> no, like I was like, you know what? I don't like that idea. And yeah. and for the first time, I was like, okay, it's okay. You don't get all your ideas all the time. Sure. And everybody that you're playing, you're with, is extremely capable. Yeah. So don't don't try to, you know. Yeah, and I think let it be. You don't know what this is. Absolutely. You don't know what this is any more than they do. Yeah. Yeah. Totally. Good point. And I think the cool thing was everybody that we were working with, producer and sound engineer included. Mm-hmm. Everybody was mm-hmm. like kind of man enough to be like man enough everybody was like mature enough to be like to be like you know when somebody else was like i think that's bad Mm -hmm. you know they were they were they were mature enough to be like okay yeah we'll take it off the table then you know which not everybody is you know when you're working with anybody who's ever worked with a creative person knows that that is not a normal thing well you know that's not a normal thing with i've I've never been in a band where Everybody was just totally down with that. Like we all say it when everybody. Oh right? yeah, like, for sure. Hey man, just give it to just me. Just let me know. Just let me know. But then yeah. just like hanging out with you and Garrett and the way you guys talk to each other. Oh yeah. I was like, oh. I was like, do they <laughs> like each other? Yeah. Like, people think. Do they like each other? For anybody who doesn't know, Garrett, the drummer in the band, people are on all, all the time, thinking about like, uh, 
we just talk. It's not that we talk combative towards each it's other. It's like you guys are related. Yeah. It's like it how me and my brother would talk to each other. Yes. Yeah. But nobody knows that what you're not. Right. And so we're all thinking, wait, what's wait, going on? Are they on? mad? Yeah, yeah. No, that's just how we, we've always kind of talked. We've been in multiple groups together, and that's always how it one is. Day we have to, we, one day we need to live tra- stream a, a Google like a Hangout. Ro- Oh gosh, <laughs> that would be fun. <laughs> we'll lose and like, like release it like twenty years from now. <laughs> okay, that's a better idea. I was gonna say we'll lose like the few fans that we have. Um, but yeah, I, I think I think nah, that man, we had a f- somebody hit me from Mozambique yesterday. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, yeah the guy with the fake name. Uh, was does, it fake? Yeah, no, nah, it's not. <laughs> it was real. I thought it was a joke at first. Um, <laughs> but <laughs> it was such a. I, I don't want to say the name, but it was such a yeah, great name. Say it. But I'm sorry, keep going. Let's no, stay on no, topic. No, you're good. It was a great name, but he was a, it was a super funny name, like <laughs> inappropriately funny name. But he just <laughs> was saying the most serious stuff. He was very nice. He was just like, you know, the Lord say. <laughs> dude, I know he was like <laughs> preaching like, into our like, lives, right, dude. Right, okay. um, I feel this. But anyway, yeah, man, I think everybody kind of had our backs. I feel like. You know, I guess for those who don't know, me and Aaron wrote most of the music. Mm-hmm. Well, I most wrote the lyrics. I guess music lyrics and music, yeah. too, like, for the most part. And then just because everybody else had already kind of moved and, yeah. you know, it was just us hanging around. So, uh, hanging around. yeah. What's so I feel like, I feel like, you know, we wrote music and then everybody else came in and, like, super had our backs as far as, like, Garrett made some really good arranging decisions. I'll talk about that one in Art Song, how yeah. he saved Art Song, which is the first track on the album. He saved that, which is amazing, because that's uh-huh. like my favorite one. And saved then, Art Song? Yeah, yeah. Oh, so I thought you were talking about Vultures for a long time. No. No, he saved Art Song. Okay. Because Art Song originally was like... You're going to give it all to him on the yeah, first episode? Yeah, here it is. <laughs> all right, here Ready? Go. Uh, yeah, because Art Song originally was like... I'm trying to think. The form was originally like... Verse, verse, pre-chorus, verse, pre-chorus, chorus. Yeah, and then and then it was like something, something, bridge, something, whatever. But then, um, but Garrett came in and was like, "Hey, the second time we do the pre-chorus, we should vamp. That we should we should repeat the pre-chorus like three times." Oh, you know what I'm talking about? Yeah. And so what it went? That's a great. Yeah. That's what great. happened is it went from feeling like this really long Art thing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it went from feeling like this really long thing that just just like repeating that pre-chorus like it makes it like it even, makes the song, yeah. Yeah, even though you're adding to it, it like it makes a a build into the highest point in the song at that time that makes sense. Yeah. Which the song did not have at yeah. that moment. It was just kind of like you know, flowy verses and pre-chorus stuff and the bam chorus <laughs> uh and in my mind i was like yeah or whatever whatever i was thinking this is be the first track and then this yeah right and then and then yeah so he to me Man, he i never like, noticed that You're yeah right. to me he really he like it was like a really small uh thing he suggested in rehearsal but it like saved the whole song in my opinion so this was in rehearsal yeah, it happened in a rehearsal. Or so, it, no, 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 no. It because was, we rewrote it, that last. It was pre-course. the. It was the. It was the first. Because we did, you know, because we kind of rehearsed before the album, but everybody was out of town, and I was yeah, like, <laughs> and I was like, hey, everybody, please learn these songs, <laughs> and everybody kind of did, uh, including me. And so, <laughs> and so, but then when it came time for the recording, we did one more kind of big push to rehearse like twice or whatever before yeah. the recording. And uh, and that was in one of those rehearsals. He made that change. So when did we rewrite the last pre-chorus? You know what I'm saying? You know how the last pre-chorus has a different words? Oh, you did it's that. Come with me. Yeah, now. you did that. Oh, in the rehearsal. Yeah, in the rehearsal. Now I'm learning. This is why we got. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> this right. This is why we have it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> to document totally these things. About this. Yeah, but that was that was it, and that was how it like saved. Because, I mean, that, 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 again, adds to, like, the forward momentum of the song. Yeah. You're right. That's, that's, I think that's what makes that song, for me, the, that that, so those too. three pre-courses make the song worth how, like, dredge, dredge, dredging, <laughs> dredge. No, keep fighting, dude. I want to, I want to, I'm going to keep all How dredgedly the first two <laughs> verses. Jeez. Golly. <laughs> how dredgedly the first two verses. Put in the comments what he should have said. <laughs> 
but I don't mean drugs yeah, yeah, in a no, bad way. But I, I think mean, you're. Heavy, I think you're right though. Heavy, like, right. Like, yeah. Yeah. For sure. For sure. Especially for the first album. For the first song on the album. On the album. Yeah. So, <clears throat> I think it's worth it whenever you get those three. Like, come with me now, please. Yeah. Thanks. Mm-hmm. Drums are going. Gah, 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 gah. Yeah. Totally. Straight into the chorus for the first time. Yep. It's great. We never do it like that live. But nope, <laughs> we never do. Every for everybody who ever hears us live, we get there every time, and everybody has this moment where we all look at each other and we go, "One more? Wait, pre chorus? Last gig we did, we did the chorus twice, Ugh. which never even happens in the song. I don't think. I think last. See, now I'm even questioning the myself. The last gig we did, I looked at you a weird way, but it wasn't because I was lost. But because you thought I was lost, you cued everybody for it. Oh. Was, you were just like, I'm making the decision. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I was like, oh, dang, my bad. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you can't look at me, dude. I'll like, I'm going to try to pick everybody up, carry you on my back. It takes a long time for people to understand my eye contact. Yeah. Especially like, just like gigs that are not Lark. Because I'm just looking at them. I don't know. The way, it, like all my looks are the same. And they mean different things. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> like, like this means you're messing up. Like this means you're killing. You're it. crushing. <laughs> yeah. I actually know the difference between those. Thanks. I actually do. Yeah. I actually do. My brother knows them. Your brother? Yeah. I Dude, feel like I'm whenever gonna get, I play I'm going to get your brother on an episode of this. Bro, my brother. I don't know if he would kill it or not. Who knows? I think he would, dude. Why? Uh, I think. About let, me, let me. Yeah. <laughs> I think I would have a good time talking with him. That's all I'm saying. Okay. All that's, right. That's probably true. Yeah. He's a cool guy. Uh, yeah, so... I, but that's so, basically what the pod's going to be about. Yeah, is, you know, just to, to expose, you know, those kinds of things about songwriting, music. I mean, even, even like, this is even a place where we could talk about, like, chord voicings. You know, we got we got this keyboard set up just, hey. just to do some, like, MIDI. <laughs> right? Okay, so, yeah, <laughs> that's, a, that's a patch I edited. No big deal. So yeah, I mean, yeah, you know, I think I think that's another aspect is we want to make it, you know, on the spot, like that also. And I think what we're gonna do in the future is I was, we were just talking about this before we turned on the camera is I think I'm gonna stream it all on Twitch, mm. um, get at least get into the habit of that. that way. You know, at the end maybe we can take questions. Yeah. If I look over and somebody says something funny, talk maybe. about it. You know, whatever. Maybe, but I, I think because to me like. I, I mean, you listen to a lot of podcasts. Yeah. I don't as much as I used to, but I, I used to listen to a ton of podcasts. My wife listened to a bunch of podcasts. And I think, to me, the thing that it's missing is, I wish I was in that conversation. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, yeah. And so, I... Whoa, yeah. Right? Yeah, yeah there's some convos where I'm just Brand like, master. <laughs> Make sure you do a zoom in. When you like, Womp. <laughs> um... Yeah, like there's some conversations I'd be like, well, like, like I'll be like I listen to Joe Budden podcast like every week, and he'll say like he says something about a jazz musician mm. the other week, and he was like, what's this, you know, person's name, something, 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 and I just want like it's something that I, like a regular person, or even like a really person that's into music but doesn't know about jazz wouldn't know. Yeah, I just wanted to be like. John Coltrane. <laughs> right, yeah, yeah, <laughs> it wasn't yeah. John Coltrane, but but it was yeah, I know like what you that. mean, though. Yeah. You know what I mean? That would have been, like, dope. You know? uh, also, as a person who, who is on Twitch or who, like, watches stuff on Twitch. Yeah, I don't do the Twitch thing. You got love it. watching small streamers and, like, asking them the most random questions and then he- just hearing them respond. A- anybody who watches Twitch knows exactly what I'm talking about. <laughs> like, you're watching some dude play some old video game. He's got, like, He's got like 20 followers and five viewers, and you can just be like, so, waffles or pancakes. <laughs> and he's like, pancakes, here's I'm so, why. I'm sorry to bust your bubble. This is not going to be a small podcast. Oh, I like it. You're right. <laughs> but, you but I'm saying that there's an interactive. Or, 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 <laughs> or, or every time it gets to, how many, like, is too much? Like, uh, like I think, like, I think like when you cross the line into, like, 20 to 30 interactive viewers... Okay, in a chat. A lot. Okay, what, all right. Let's say. I think I think it's still doable, but like. Let's say every time you get to harder. 100, we change. We change ch- everything. Totally, no, like we totally change channels. Like <laughs> a new account. You have to. We're like it. a pop-up channel. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You have, actually, that's kind of sick. You have to find it every time. That's, that's kind of sick too. Maybe. Maybe. It's like it's like a pop-up shop, you know. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Pop-up oh, channel. Pop-up channel. Was that, was that a thing? No. 
Hey. Brand Sweet. masters. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, I think I think that's what that's what I would like this to be. And also, like, for, I think everybody kind of knows this now. But if you're watching this, you probably watch our other content. Aaron edits all of that, and he's got a great artistic voice. Um, and so every you're kind of seeing the band through. I agree. <laughs> All right, chill, <laughs> chill. Um, you're kind of seeing the band through like Aaron's artistic lens, which is great. Yeah. And I think this is just another way, you know, yeah. to experience Lark and like what we're thinking, what we're going through. And yeah, I'm pro- excited to see like, I I didn't think about it that way at first. I mean, I think people kind of notice because I'm always like uh, narrating those vlogs basically. I mean, I, oh, yeah. I want you guys to be in, but it's always yeah. But I'm always the one shooting, basically. You know, a lot of the time. Yeah. So it, I never thought of it as being my point of view, but I think that's dope. Like it's good though. I think it's good. I think too. it's a good one. Yeah. <clears throat> I do that. It's like I'm doing that one. Yeah. You're gonna like ha- take this on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because you know you're moving across the country. Right. Um. Um. So I won't be there, but you guys are gonna keep keep this thing going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Me and Garrett. Garrett lives in L.A. Yeah. Me and my family we're moving to L.A. And, uh, hey, I want. I need to have things where I can like do a round of applause. Ba, 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 ba. Uh, we can set that up. <laughs> yeah, I need we'll to set that up. Main stage. Main stage. <laughs> yes, dude. So, uh, so yeah, like I'm excited to see what you're gonna do with this. Yeah, and I'm excited too. I'm Just have like, another format. Come back in six months and. Yeah, dude. Over there and right now, Aaron's Aaron's taking a trip. Taking a trip. Taking a trip. And there's gonna be more about that. Yeah, more about that. It's gonna be sick though. I don't want him to get fired from my life. It's gonna be sick though. This year, this year is gonna be yeah, fair enough. <laughs> this year is uh, this year is gonna be exciting for the band. We're really going to, we're all kind of in a little bit of transition period. So the shows, uh, the shows that we're doing will be less frequent. Mm-hmm. But um, we just recorded a second project. We're working on a third. Yeah. Uh, which is going to be sick. Yeah. And then... There's, like, a lot of small things that are going to happen with that project that are going to be coming out. Yeah, totally. Um, and so, you know, so 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 really what we're going to do is we're, is we're, like, putting out a ton of content this year. Yeah. And so, like, you know, hop along for the ride. Yeah, when you said shows, lot. when you said shows, you meant, like, like concerts. Yeah, yeah, I mean, like, live concerts. No, 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 I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah, I mean, like, live concerts. Um, but, uh, yeah, you know, which is exciting. This is a cool time for our band to be doing this too. Cause you know, we had an album come out, it had a certain amount of success. And the cool thing was we all walked away from it being like, nice man. Like yeah. we all felt really good. I, yeah. I, I think we all felt really good about the album, but then, you know, there's, I think it kind of encourages us to, to it's chase after a particular voice. Yeah. You know what I mean? Which is cool. No, we know what's capable. Yeah. Yeah. Like yeah. I feel like. I feel like I, I, during that record, I found out where I see where our ceiling could be. Totally, totally. And it's nowhere near that. Oh really. no, no, no! It's way so, higher. So yeah, so it's sick. Like you know, we're gonna be. This is like this is gonna be a huge growing year. I think in a different way. This is normally like kind of the hard part for most bands. Like this is. Let's see, what year is this for us? Three. Three. This is our third year as a band. It's crazy. First year publicly as a band. Yeah, um, not but, even a whole year. Yeah, not even a whole year, but but this is where it gets tough because it's a bit. This is the grind, mm-hmm. but we're doing it in a really kind of specific way that we're all pretty excited about. Yeah, um, which is really cool. Let me say, I can't even stop smiling right now. He's not even smiling. <laughs> um, <laughs> I'll zoom in right there. <laughs> so yeah, man. Yeah. Okay, so this is like the introductory episode. Yep. Uh, uh, yeah, that's introduction. It's kind of how it's gonna go. It's gonna be more structured, of course. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Um, but, if, um, if you're watching this video thanks but also if you're watching this video and you're like i really wish they would talk about this or they need this they need to change this on the screen or it sounds like boo boo this is if how you're thinking that keep it to yourself <laughs> no, we don't no i was gonna say put it in the comments <laughs> no put, for sure put it in the comments let us know uh yeah yeah, don't DM us. Put it in the comments. Yeah, yeah, for sure, for sure. <laughs> so comments. somebody else can be like, yeah, or you suck. Yeah. And then another thing that, man, I love is just a <laughs> solid internet beef. Uh, yeah, Holy listen, moly. If you want to get an internet beef, just hit up Josh. Yeah, He's dude. He's definitely going to be the reason. I'm down. Articles written about I'm us. down. <laughs> I am, dude. I don't know why. So if you want that to happen sooner than later. <laughs> just get in there. <laughs> <laughs> just get in there. <laughs> but, uh. It'll, it'll be different than you think. It's going to turn out different than you think it is. That's yeah. all I'm saying. So next episode, we're probably going to... Not probably. Next episode, we're going to talk with uh, 
<coughs> the producer of our band. Yeah, Blake, man. Blake Wren. He had a huge, he had a huge, uh, you know, effect creatively on that album. Yeah, I we're mean, giving you a sneak peek to the next episode. Oh baby, Crazy. oh baby, oh baby. Oh, baby. Uh, yeah, I mean he, I mean it was it was mastered a certain way because of him. There's a lot of artistic decisions that were made. Maybe what we'll probably do, what would be cool, we'll run through some of the songs. And he can, like, yeah, stop and sure. be like, oh, we added this because of blah, blah, blah. Yeah. You know, he's got, like, these huge, huge ears on him. Yeah. Uh, so it's like, you know, he hears a bunch of stuff that I don't hear. Yeah. Um, About to make an ear joke, but that would have been too obvious. Yeah, yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> Dang. Uh, he doesn't even have, he has the musical big ears. Yeah, he has, he has normal ears. ears. He has normal ears. Yeah, he's not human, like, human he's not like Garrett, so. Wow. Listen, next time you watch took, a vlog... I took that as an offense. Looks at, that's <laughs> fine. Next time you watch a vlog, look how tiny Garrett's ears are. It is hilarious. <laughs> it's so funny. They look like snack foods. <laughs> <laughs> they do, dude. I don't know why. Snack foods is something that you would only see. It's like... Your teacher is like... Your third, third grade year old son is like, Hey, bring snack foods for yeah, me. Yeah, that's true. Well... Garrett's ears look What's like What's your future food. son's name? My future son's name? Dude, we've been trying to think of something. Mm, not if you, Joshua. If, if you got, no. <laughs> not not Lil' J Jr. or something like that. Lil' J? <laughs> no. Uh, or, that wouldn't be Lil' J. It would be JJ. If you have, if, if you have, I'm not doing that. If you have, <laughs> if you have ideas for my son's name, put it in the comments. <laughs> uh, anyway. Sick, man. Cool. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what it's going to be. It's gonna be sick. Thanks for hanging out with us. Uh, thanks for tuning in. Lark cast. I kind of like that. Yeah, that's what it's. I think that's what I'm gonna call it. Lark cast with no C. Okay, so just L A R K A S T. Garrett's gonna hate this idea. Yeah, Garrett's not gonna <laughs> like that. We're doing it. 